Hey Glam Doll, so I wanted to do um, my update video on some hair that I got from Only Hair. It is a Ally Express company and they sent me three bundles. Um, I didn't purchase this hair, but they did send me three bundles of their Peruvian kinky hair. And I didn't get a chance to, and I did not get a chance to actually wear the hair. What I did was I had to make a wig slash jus part because I just I don't feel like putting all the hair in right now so I did make a wig out of the hair and I'm just going to share with you my experiences with the hair so far or thus far um, what I will do is I'll probably just take some pictures of me wearing the hair and put those on my blog because I probably won't be wearing the hair until next week so if you want to see those pictures just go to my blog and they'll be there so let me just talk to you about the hair so far um, again they sent me three bundles of Peruvian kinky hair now I've never heard of Peruvian kinky hair. If you have, please, please, please leave me a comment below and tell me you guys have seen you guys have seen it before. I haven't seen it, nor have I heard of it. Now, I will tell you that um, this hair, as far as shedding, it shed a little bit. Now, I have to, I'm going to show you the wig that I actually made with this hair, and I'm going to tell you, you know, actually let me just show it to you now. So this is this is Tina. So this is the wig that I made with this hair. Um, the lengths that they gave me were 12, 14, and 16. So this is the 16 at the bottom. And you know, of course, the 14 and the 12. Um, I was gonna make this a U part and I wasn't sure if I wanted to make it a full wig or a U part. So I did leave out a little bit of hair. This is the wig I have to cut off. I did leave out a little section for me to make a U part, but I also, did a closure here at the top so if I decide I just want to wear really big Diana Ross-ish hair I can excuse me I can do that um so this is the wig and I didn't cut a lot of the hair um you know to do this I did cut the top and I did cut a couple pieces on the side where I made my slice for my U um now with that being said um the hair did shed I'm gonna leave it up she, well, I'll put it this way. She's my model. So, um, the hair did shed a little bit because I did cut the hair. The rest of the hair I did the fold over method with. And, you know, kind of, kind of me just kind of, you know, pulling my hands through it. I noticed that the hair was shedding. And I'm not sure exactly why because it, actually my 14 inch, I didn't cut that hair. And when I was pulling my fingers through kind of just to give it some, uh oh, <laughs> when I was cut, combing my fingers through it just to give it some body the hair was like starting to shake you know I wanted to make the hair big and kind of play with it a little bit I was getting a little bit of hair now of course our natural hair sheds so it's nothing crazy but I did get a couple strands and the strands actually came from an area that I didn't cut so I was a little concerned about that but you know I did want to share that with you it may not be a concern for you ladies but I do want to give you all of the facts now one thing that I will personally say about this hair now for you ladies who have been wearing extensions for a long time this hair reminds me of the old school deep wave hair that you get from your local beauty supply store that was like 10 15 dollars a pack this is what this hair I shouldn't even say deep wave dear um the jerry curl hair that's what this hair reminds me of it was so funny when I made this wig I was like oh my god I feel like I'm in middle school again but this is what this hair reminded me of now these curls are the bomb Oh my god, this curl, I love this tight curl. And I like it because I like curls to be very, very tight and then kind of like a straw set. I just love it because when this hair falls and you kind of run your fingers through it, it gets looser and bigger and more body. Oh, I cannot wait to wear this hair. So I love the texture and the pattern of this hair. Love, love, love it. The hair is extremely soft. Now, smell, no smell. The hair that I'm currently wearing has a smell and I didn't notice it until the hair was co-washed and I didn't notice it until the hair was I was in the gym and there's a whole nother story if you want to hear about this hair I got a review on this too but anyway um this hair does not have a smell what I did was after I made my wig yeah anyway also I made this with a net not a, um, a stocking cap I mean a dome spandex cap this is a net because it's summertime and I need some ventilation um sorry sidetrack but um, when I made this wig, what I did was I co-washed the entire wig. And I did that because I really don't like to co-wash each bundle 
separately with curly hair just my thing no big deal but that's personally what I like to do so what I did was I filled my sink up with warm water well cool water I should say it was kind of cool so I filled my whole sink up with cool water and I dipped it now what I did was and this is why I leave this extra lace here because I like to have the hair laid the way it's going to lay on the wig so all of the hair is laying back and I just dipped it in the water um, the water was mixed with conditioner and I just kind of dipped it until I started to see the water foam and lather up. I just kept on dipping and kept on dipping. I left this in for about five minutes to actually soak. And then once it was complete, I took it out and I laid it on the towel just like this. Like it was just flat. I just laid it on the towel and let it air dry. So I did give it like the sniff test and the hair did not have a smell at all, which was really, really great because... If you have never had hair that smelled like corn chips before, you do not want to experience that. And I am experiencing that right now. And I am very, very upset about it. I don't want to have hair smell like corn chips. I like it's crazy. But this hair did not smell. I love the curls because the curls came right back. Now, do I think that this hair is Peruvian? Honestly, I'm not sure. Why I'm not sure? I'm really not sure. But I just have the feeling that this hair is not Peruvian hair. That's just my personal opinion. I could be wrong. I'm going to tell you that I can be wrong. But my heart is telling me that this hair is not Peruvian. So since my heart is telling me that, I'm going to tell you guys that. And you can just take it with a grain of salt. But that's my personal opinion. Um, either way, this hair is very soft. The hair, as far as the curl pattern is just concerned, it came right back. And... I love the curls so I mean right now I give this hair two thumbs up I haven't had any you know any problems with it um it, the wig looks awesome in my opinion I love how the wig came out I cannot wait to wear it and I'm actually going to be wearing this hair very soon because I'm going to be taking this install out and as soon as I wear it I am going to post pictures on my blog I just feel like posting the pictures on my blog versus doing it on YouTube is a lot easier for me and for you guys so if you guys want to see me wearing this hair just hit the blog glamforglam.com also um, I do post pictures all the time on my Instagram page so Instagram is another way to kind of just you know see the pictures really really quickly but so far so good with this hair I do like the hair I love the curl pattern it doesn't have a smell and the curls did come back and the hair is soft so that's pretty much it for this review. I mean, I don't think there's anything else that I can really say without me wearing the hair and you actually seeing how the hair looks on me. But I love the hair. It looks good on Miss um, Tiffany here. And that's pretty much it, ladies. So, I mean, this is how it looks on Tiffany. It won't be, I'll put it this way, it won't be that much different on me. It's kind of like that, um, what's her name, Tina Taylor? Tia Taylor? I'm sorry if I said her name wrong, but the the singer she wears her hair very very curly like this I mean this hair is gorgeous it's gorgeous so we are done with our review um, I hope you guys enjoyed the review I hope it was helpful because I know purchasing on Ally Express sometimes can be very very daunting but I hope this review was able to help you in your purchase if you have any additional questions please leave a comment below and I will talk to you guys soon bye